Hi, my name is Ted Ellis. I'm wearing my funky art hat. We're about to do a piece of Miles Davis. I'm going to see how fast I can create Miles Davis. Uh, he was a jazz improvisationist, a trumpeteer extraordinaire, a genius. So, I'm going to see if my genius can match his genius by um, capturing his likeness on canvas. Bye. Here's my homemade palette, environmentally friendly, and um, let's get busy. Have a little template right here to um, look at Miles so I can have a great likeness of Miles. Whew. Be fast. We'll see what we can do to make Miles happy. Hopefully, it's a good likeness of him. You guys will tell me. Don't worry about all this around That's another painting that I'm working on. I normally work on multiple paintings at the same time. But we're going to see what we can do to get Miles done right here quickly. Ah, uh, there we go. Wait till you see what I do with Miles' eyes when I get it all done right. Okay. Boom. Boom. Oh, look at that intensity on Miles' face. Yeah, it's unbelievable. It is unbelievable. Wow. He was such a great genius. My dad no longer lives. He died of cancer in 1993. He was a musician. He was a, um, a drummer, percussionist. He played by ear. Uh, dad was a phenomenal uh, musician. Played a little bit with Fast Domino just for a minute, blink of an eye. His band was the All Foods Band, and um, Irma Thomas played with my dad, uh, Walt played with my dad, Stack played with my dad. Uh, they were a little bit ahead of their time. Uh, well, not so much ahead of their time. Uh, you know, it just, um, it just didn't pop. It was uh, for them with their fame and fortune and stuff. But, uh, man, my dad could play. Uh, he used to set up the instruments in the front yard and all the neighborhood cats would come by and listen to my dad play. And I never could paint, I mean I never could play an instrument. I tried, tried sax, tried the trumpet, tried the drums, just didn't have that rhythm, that coordination. So all of my skill came right into my painting. I mean that's, that's it, right here. This is where it all came at. And uh, you know, blessed to be able to realize that, enjoy it, and uh, make the best of it. Yeah, I think it's going to be a pretty decent Miles piece. You know, quick, fast, interpretive, um, you know, just wonderful piece. And, um, uh, working it, working it, working it, working it. You know, it's kind of like lights and shadows. The photographer who took this piece did a great job of capturing the personality and likeness of Miles. Um, I hope I do it justice in my painting. So, um... You know, here we go. I mean, I love it. I love painting. And I pictorially document African American culture. I want folks to know that, you know, that art gives you everything. Uh, anything that you look for, it's able to give you that. And that's the beauty in art. You know, it's right here, right now. It speaks to you politically, socially, culturally, academically. I mean, look at it. That's my miles. That's me working my brush, working my magic. This is it. Let me teach you how to paint. It's not that hard. Plus, it's refreshing. It energizes you. It sustains you. It makes you feel good. Uh, man, art is holistic. It's wholesome. It teaches you. It inspires you. It motivates you. It gives you hope. It gives you personality. It gives you love. It makes you connect with the universe. And that's all the arts, not just the visual arts. That's why we're so much in love with it. And we support it so much, you know. That's why we got to continue to give funding to the arts, because it's vital to our our lifestyle, our preservation, our quality of life, all those wonderful things uh, and more. Uh, so uh, that's part of the shadow with Miles right here. When I'm getting that intensity in, you know, it's like wow, bam, 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 Ooh, I'm sweating in my garage. I always paint it in the garage. I always paint it at the, the kitchen front table. You know, that's Ted Ellis, T. Ellis Way. And uh, uh, I probably in my lifetime have painted over uh, 5,000 paintings, you know, easily. I've uh, been painting professionally now for about 20-something years. 
Uh, I take that back. It's actually about 17 years, 17, 18 years, full-time professionally. And I get to travel the United States. have not yet gone abroad yet with my art, but that's my ambition. Uh, and I work a lot with the kids now in the community, fundraising activities and so forth, you know, just to help out the way I can, you know. I uh, just want to inspire, want to change the world, and make it a better place. I mean, that's it. That's how we leave our legacy. So, wow, miles, miles, miles. Wow. Way to live, way to make that impression. Okay, now. We do some half tones, little shadows and stuff. Well, let me get a little bit more here and there. And voila. Oh no. Oh. I'm almost gonna have like a little charcoal effect. I'm painting strictly with acrylics and making it happen. You know. Miles, miles, miles. Find my miles. Yep. So see, you can do this too. You just gotta have fun. You gotta wanna be able to, you know, take the time, you know, pour me, boom. All right, hey. So, in a nutshell, there's a quick artistic interpretation of jazz impresario Miles Davis. Eat your heart out. I love it. Hey. Yeah,